Hey guys, welcome back to Gallardo Garage. Um, today I wanted to show you a little bit of uh, more kind of like a work and adventure kind of thing. And today I'm going to be going uh, camping with my friends. So that means I got to prepare the Tacoma right here. So it's the first time that I got this uh, Tacoma in the shop now and it is uh, surprisingly taking all the room it has just because my shop is 20 by uh, 20. So. This truck is, I believe, like 18 and some uh, some change, so uh, barely room to walk around. But it's in. I lifted it up, uh, so I got a couple things to do today. Gonna rotate the tires, pump them up, and I got to do an oil change. So and I got to do a little bit of cleaning up and packing up to do. So I'm gonna put the GoPro right here for a little bit, and then you'll see me kind of get busy. And if I have some time, I'm planning to uh, actually maybe do the side lower in like a darker color with a vinyl wrap but uh, we'll see because I gotta leave in a few hours and pack up uh, and then eat some lunch and then take off so it's gonna be a busy day but I figured I'll get some cameras and record this and maybe uh, make this into a little uh, nice little video and then also too let's uh, talk about what I'm gonna need for the oil chain so here we are with the oil change materials and basically what um, I need, what I needed to get and I got over uh, Black Friday was a deal on this Mobile 020. Uh, it was this the advanced fuel economy blend, blend or something like that. Synthetic, got a Bosch filter, and then right here I got an oil drain uh, plug. Uh, so basically there's going to be some sort of Allen key that I have to uh, remove and insert this into and this will drain the oil cleanly but uh, still have uh, to figure that out and then most importantly is the oil filter wrench this one is a motive tools so this uh, has the pattern and hopefully this fits or else uh, nothing else is going to happen no oil change so let's see um, if this all works together and so essentially that's uh, from what I understand this is what you need but I will be grabbing some tools and whatnot. Let's uh, just get this GoPro started over there and get to work.